getting young people committed to live in small town Iowa is something we're, we're fighting every day and housing is probably the central piece to that. Having the ability for recruitment and retention of workforce is, is, a, is a key for our future. Uh, it's, it's a key for the next generation. My name is Brett Barker and I'm the mayor of the city of Nevada. And one reason why we work on workforce housing in particular is because we outpunch our weight class and in industry. We have multinational corporations all here in our community. They've all been growing. They've had multiple expansions. So we're really excited to work on that, provide them a place so they can really be part of the fabric of the community because it's what makes Nevada special. My name is Jordan Cook. I'm the city administrator of Nevada, Iowa. We have a, a large work-based community here with several different industries that provide a lot of different jobs for us. We have a lot of different fun activities that really will help improve quality of life. And the great thing about Nevada is it's a wonderful place to live and people from all of these industries really want to be in Nevada. I'm Adam Thomas. I'm the vice president here at RJ Thomas Manufacturing. Currently we employ around 92 employees. We've lost a lot of housing to the flooding that's happened this year. But even before the flooding, there's always been a shortage of housing. Lynn Evans, Iowa Senator. Now Iowa already has a, a significant workforce development housing credit available. We have to be able to build attractive housing, uh, the type of housing that people are, are looking for, that they want to live in, and that's what we're looking for in rural development. 